Hey guys, Warcock here again with another airsoft gun. And as you can tell, it is of the SNT PPSH 41. And this is how the box looks like. If you're wondering how it looks, nothing special. The picture is in the corner. And this one came with the drama magazine. You can you can also get the uh, stick type uh, magazines, but you have to buy those separately. So that's that. Now let's open it. When you first open the box, this is what you'll see: a foam cover. Just remove that. The gun, the magazine, and that's it. The battery is not included, and some. Um, silica gel to keep the box smelling fresh now that I have the gun out let me start by saying that the gun is made entirely out of metal and real wood the whole barrel uh, upper receiver trigger and trigger guard are made out of real metal as well as the magazine the whole stock is made out of real wood so that's another cool thing about the weapon. Inside the stock is where the battery is housed. Simply opening this tab and inside pushing a button, um, re releasing the whole uh, stock plate to insert a battery. A 9.6 volt battery is recommended for this gun. So if you have one, it would be uh, wise to use it. The sights here are adjustable from this and flipping it back. So if I can do it, there you go, like that. The front sight is not adjustable, it is a fixed sight. The magazine holds 2,000 rounds and the magazine uh, release is right here. Simply pulling it all the way forward will re release the magazine. The SNT PPSH features the electric blowback so every time you pull the trigger the bolt will move back and forth. To access the hop-up, what you would want to do is pull the bolt all the way back, lock it. From here you can see the hop-up, which is this wheel. While the bolt is like this, the gun is on safe, so you won't be able to fire it. To fire the weapon, simply release the bolt. And then you can pull the trigger so you can hear that click to load the magazine what you would want to do first is unlock this pin right here then unscrew this screw from here you can take the magazine plate out revealing what's inside this is where you pour in your BBs after you pour your BBs, put the plate back on and screw it back again and locking it. And that is how you load the magazine. Okay, now that I have the camera mounted onto a tripod so I can do this with two hands. The gun features a quick spring change system by simply first removing the magazine and then this is important pulling the, the bolt back locking it and then tapping this forward allowing you to like almost break the gun in half from here. You have access to the inner barrel, your hop-up unit, and the spring guide right here, which you can change. 
So that is how you change the spring on this gun. This gun shoots at around 360 feet per second with a 0.2 gram BB. With the changing of the spring, that FPS will vary depending on the spring you put on it. For all you war reenactors or World War II collectors, this is one that I highly recommend getting. Okay, so then this has been my little review of the SNT PPSH 41. Hope you liked it. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, please comment and I will do my best to reply back. Until next time, I'll see you then.